It's time for a super simple Santa baby. Yeah, 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 let's do it. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Hopefully you are doing well out there and taking care of yourself. Let's go ahead and get ready and get into this video. First things first, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't done so, that's right. Hit the bell notifications. That way you know every time I drop a video, you can get your hands on it and start to learn some more balloonage. Is that a word? Eh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> so that's right. Yes, don't forget to subscribe to that channel. I really do appreciate it. Uh, it helps me, uh, you know, just, just be out there uh, more and more so you guys can see some cool balloons that you can use. Alrighty. Um, next thing is um, the merch shop. That's right. If you haven't check it, checked it out, um, I got some cool t-shirts in there. Um, uh, you can you can definitely see for yourself and get yourself one. I really appreciate it. Um, it's just another way that you can support the channel, support the channel, and also get yourself a cool T-shirt. Why not? Anyway, uh, last but not least, before we get into the balloons we're going to use to make that super simple Santa baby, um, say that three times fast. I dare you. Alrighty, and um, that is I'm going to do a Black Friday sale, and I was looking at how much my video tutorials cost. Um, and uh, I, was, I was thinking probably um, for everything. So here's what the sale is gonna be. Um, I try to do like the same sale every year. For, so for anybody who hasn't gotten my video tutorials, this is a chance for you to get them on the cheap. So $50 um, and if you're interested in that, reach out to me and uh, we'll connect and we'll make it happen. So it's gonna be my Black Friday sale, $50 for all my balloon video tutorials off my website, okay? Not from the channel here, you get all these goodies here already anyway, but I'm talking about the other tutorials that I have, uh, $50. So anyway, um, yes, we got that all out of the way, so let's go ahead and get to the balloons we're going to use to make that Santa baby. Super simple Santa baby. Alright, let's do it. So here are the things I'm using. I have an uninflated baby head right there, balloon baby head. And then we also have our three colors here. I have a blush, a red, and a white, and my U-glue dashes okay i'm going to use that to attach the hat and so let's go ahead and talk about how much balloon is left over obviously a whole lot of the balloon you'll be able to probably get three uh, um you know brims in the little uh, cotton ball for the, I, was trying to think, I was going to call it a snowball the cotton ball for the uh for the hats and then red is also going to be for the little diaper and you could definitely do the baby in all red so it's like you know really like you know looking like Santa, all dressed in all red, but I think it's just cute to have a red diaper. And then we have blush for the baby's body. And you can see also for the red, uh, not using all of that um, balloon for that. And then for the blush, actually, um, this one that is the only one I would pay mine to, because um, you're gonna use pretty much most of it, or all of it. Um, but look, I have overhands grip left over there and I give it a good squish, okay? It's just so at the end, because I, I wanna make sure that the hands are a loop and a pinch twist. And that's pretty much it. But if you just want to have the nubs, um, like a, like a, as in taught, like in the original baby, I think that I did, um, it was just like the little nubs and it wasn't just, you know, like a Powerpuff Girl hands, you know, they're just little nubs, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and get started, shall we? We're gonna go ahead and build the baby body first and then we'll do uh, the rest, all right. Okay, there we go. And about uh, two fingers on that and then we'll do ourselves. Get ourselves a pinch twist. I go three times. Okay. Now you notice that I didn't inflate the 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 baby head uh, yet. I'll show you. I, I actually did something different. I wanted to make sure to share it here. Okay. So it won't be just the the balloon baby like we all know, or some of us. Um, but it'll, but it'll be you know try to switch it up a little bit in terms of um, what do we do at that part when it comes time to attach the head. And uh, I just switched it up just a little bit. Nothing, nothing uh, earth shattering or <laughs> nothing wild and crazy, but uh, just, you know, if you've been doing something for a while, you just try one day to try it, just do it differently. Cause uh, you know what I noticed, um, like twisting with other twisters, like back when, like years ago, when we were doing live events, you remember those times? It make you sad to think back on those times. <laughs> anyway, uh, uh, oh, by the way, for you, there you go. No, um, it, but my point was, yeah, is, is when you twist along other twisters uh, alongside them, you see that they do things like a little bit differently than you do sometimes. So it's real interesting to see that. All right, so anyway, uh, that was my point, just trying things differently, that's all. All right, so 
Um, before I get ready to, oh, actually I'm gonna go right to the white balloon. Let me show you why I'm gonna do that actually. I'm gonna go ahead and create my little uh, brim of the hat here and the, the little uh, cotton ball. There we go, I like that. And we don't need the rest of this. Didn't break that off and I will keep that. All right, I know someone was out there watching this video with their hands open, ready to catch it. I'm so sorry. All right, so we're gonna leave this here for now. Okay, that's gonna be for our hat. I'm just gonna actually put it under the uh, edge of my shirt there. That way it doesn't try to get away. All right, let's go ahead and get ready to add this. And so I'm just holding on right there. And we'll just go around a couple times. So I, yeah, so I'll just pinch in the nozzle there between my fingers. That way I can go around the pinch switch there. So I'm just gonna go this way. So I'm just going across the belly there to the other pin twist, and I'm going to go right back on the flip side. All right, so in the past, at this point, I would have kept some of this so I could pull it across, and I'm going to skip that today. Okay, ready? And for some of you guys, you know what's funny is, you know, uh, we, we sometimes run across something that we thought was so original, and then you got people that are like, bro, we've been doing that for years. <laughs> where, where you been? All right. So for me, uh, I was just playing with this and, and, and this is what I come up with when it comes time to attach the head. But um, I went ahead and broke this off and I'm not letting it go because I'm gonna twist it in here. That's why I made this ahead of time. So now I can make sure that this little baby will go in there, okay? All right, good. Okay, so now I can actually start to get this created so that when we have the head on, we can put it on, okay? Because otherwise I have to tie this off somewhere while I get ready to make this. So it made more sense to make this first, put on the diaper, and then come back and put this together, okay? Hopefully that makes sense to you. Yes, kind of, sort of. Trying to uh, make sure that, um, trying to be about smarter about the order in which I do things, so. Okay, all right, so I just twist it on the bottom there. And I'm gonna go ahead and break it off there. Good, I'm actually gonna tie it. I don't always tie it right there at the edge, but there we go. See how I did that? Okay, and I'm just gonna pull that right across there. This is pretty darn secure. I think it's gonna stay, I'm gonna go over the top there. Good, okay. And now I'll be able to put my, so I got some balloon right there. I can attach the ugly dash right there and that way it'll right on there. With the sound effects, it's gonna go like this. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> never missed the opportunity for a raspberry. I think that's the sound, right? A raspberry, is that what they call it? All righty, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and plate this guy. Keep it nice and round. I think that looks pretty good. Not tying it off, just going to give it a twist. And it's just so I can just jam it down inside there. with that nozzle there we go I got it okay so all I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna I'm not gonna pull see right now I'm just pulling it straight down right and I'm trying to keep it pretty tight now though I'm gonna uh, loosen up on that tension a little bit and I'm just gonna go around one pinch, pinch twist or the other that'll be up to you to decide which one you want to put it on so whichever way whichever side it goes on that's fine that's not that's not the point the point is is that you don't have to, in the past, I would run a uh, piece of balloon across the middle here. Uh, in this case, it was the diaper. And then I would wrap the balloon like around that. And this and this just, you know, cut all of that out by just going straight down, pulling it, you know, uh, nice and snug. And then went, and then just go to the left or the right and just put it around the pinch twist and we're good to go, okay? Alrighty, so now that we've done this and that we've made our hat, um, we can go ahead and grab one of our little U-glue dashes by the way, if you're trying to get some of these, um, I do have a link in my description below. Uh, we can go ahead and get some, and that's another way um, you can support the channel when you use my link. Um, I'll get a little kickback that way too, okay? So I'm just attaching it right there. That's all I'm doing. And I'll show you, see? And now I can go and peel up off the back of it. And we'll be good to go, look at that. And I'll just put that baby right on there, like I said, Sound effect, it's ready, <laughs> it's ready to go. So anyway, um, I like it, let's see. Good, it's gonna stay. Okay, just wanna make sure it stays on there nice and good. 
pretty good. Okay, let me go ahead and flip it around this way so you can see. Pretty good. Now, as an alternative, you don't have the baby faces, um, especially just if, okay, so some people just have the round balloon here, right, the five inch, but they also, on the Rocks uh, website, there is the quick link baby face also, okay? So if you already have those, then you can definitely do that. That was part of the purpose of them, so you could be able to do something like this, like lickety split, right? Same thing for the Grinch heads. They have the link, so you can add the hat just like that. No problem. Alrighty. So anyway, there it is right there. You can see it's all yours. It's super simple to do. Um, and I think that'll bring the twisting portion to a conclusion. But um, I do want to give away one of my uh, balloon tutorials. Um, you let me know, um, you know, when, when you, because I'm about to bring up the question. Okay. Um, it, but first I want to make sure that you had the prize and what it's going to be so that way you know what you win uh, That is if uh, you are the first person to comment. Okay, first person to comment correctly with the answer. Okay um, You will win uh, any Any two downloads that you want from my website. Okay, so you have to go there and check them out uh, Don't worry. It's jlamagic.com and it's under balloon tutorials pretty easy to do So here's the question at the beginning of this video um, there was something in the screen here, okay? Nothing got added, but something did get taken away, okay? If you know what it is, okay, hit me up, let me know, right? Be the first person to comment with the correct answer, alrighty? Something that was at the beginning of this video and now it is not here, okay? So something did not get added, something got subtracted, okay? So anyway, um, thank you very much for hanging out with me. Again, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate it. Um, don't forget to comment if you like this balloon. I always like that too as well. And I try to get on there and chat with you guys as much as possible. And then don't forget to do visit the merch shop. Yes. Alrighty, so I'll catch up to you guys next time. Happy to see everybody. Bye.